Superstar Susan Sexton, for those of you that were LPWA fans, remember, was given the world championship without ever having to wrestle anyone. And her very first opponent was Misty Blue Sims, a wrestler who felt she should have been in contention for that world championship. And now, from Don Laughlin's Riverside Resort and Casino in Laughlin, Nevada, it's the Super Ladies of Wrestling! Weighing in at 120 pounds from South Glen Falls, New York, Misty Blue Sims. Weighing in at 125 pounds from Perth, Australia, superstar Susan Sexton. Well, Sarge, this is our first look at a very controversial champion. Uh, I know you and I were very surprised when we got here when we saw this match. Misty Blue Sims versus... LPWA champion, superstar Sexton. My first question is, if this is the inaugural event of the LPWA, how in the world she was the champion, for whatever reason, in their infinite wisdom, the LPWA committee decided to award superstar Sexton the championship belt. We will find out very shortly just how successful she's going to be in defending that belt because Misty Blue Slim's about as tough as it comes. Well, Susan Sexton is definitely a tough cookie herself, and this should be quite a match. I just don't know why they gave her the championship. I'd like to see a tournament for it, but uh, she is a good, good wrestler and will be a good champion. Well, we will have a tag team tournament coming up for that vacant title, but this match one, you and I said, as soon as we saw the matchups, we could have looked at each other. This one should be a Jim Dandy, without question, the main event today. I'll tell you right here at the Riverside Resort, I hate to put money on this one. And Misty Blue goes right after the champion, catches her in the midsection. And a second time, Misty Blue wasting no time in the superstar, bailing out, suddenly saying, wait a minute, I'm the champion, what in the world's going on? Well, she came walking in that ring, uh, looked like she owned the world, and uh, took Misty Blue Sims a little bit lightly there. Uh, maybe she may own the world, but South Glen Falls is not a part of Superstar's world at the moment, that's for certain. Misty Blue now going right up, setting her up for a suplex, takes her right over, and she's wasting no time. Now she goes for the leg, spinning toe. She's trying to set her up for a figure four, but Superstar kicked her right off. Well, I talked to uh, Misty Blue Sims right before the matches here, and she said what an upset it would be to become the uh, LPWA world champion right here. And Superstar, a couple of punches to the midsection, but Misty Blue goes right to the work, drops that knee in that hamstring area. And Superstar Sexton, the LPWA champion right now in a world of hurt. That's right. Misty Blue goes for the armbar, takes her off the ropes. Oh! Uh, I'll tell you what, she was trying to decapitate her right then and there. And suddenly Superstar wants no part of a very fired up Misty Blue Sims. He's going after that title, killer. There is no question, Sarge. What an upset it would be right here. The first uh, match on the new uh, LPWA Championship Wrestling Show to have a new champion. Well, the crowd firmly behind Misty Blue is they're chanting blue, blue, blue. Superstar played a little possum. Misty Blue Sims waited just a little bit too long there to let her catch her breath. She did. That's one of the reasons. Superstar six in a ring bet. Oh, she took her right over. Came down right on top of her. Susan Sexton looks like she knows what she's doing up there. Wow. Oh, Misty Blue comes right back bottom with a mid 
midsection, went for a count, but not quite on the superstar. Superstar Sexton, for me, Sarge, is one of the most technical wrestlers, very, very methodical in her ring style. And Misty Blue going for cross body block, gets hung up in the ropes. Superstar now to try to take her right out over, and Misty Blue comes right down to the table in front of us. Oh, here they come again. And they're going right outside the ring. Superstar Sexton right in front of us. And she gives referee Jesse Hernandez a whack. Now, wait a minute. She's trying to bring it right over. She's got it right over here on the table in front of us. Superstar goes right to work. Well, wait a minute. Referee Jesse Hernandez is raising the hand of a fallen Misty Blue Sims. Superstar Sexton, very irate. We'll try and get the referee's decision as he goes over to decision. But Ladies and gentlemen, winner by disqualification, Misty Blue Sims. Sarge, you're exactly right. Superstar Sexton deliberately threw over. Now, we should clarify things. The title does not change hands. Right. Referee Superstar Sexton, very upset. But again, remember, the title cannot change. You shut up! Definitely a tough champion. She is that. Good, no mercy. But again, I want to remind everyone, here in the LPWA, the title cannot change hands on a disqualification. Even though Misty Blue Sims, the winner, Superstar Sexton retains the title. But I'll tell you what, side. Here's my disqualification, Misty Blue Sims. Misty Blue Sims has got to be in line for a title shot. And I don't think we have heard the end of this feud between Misty Blue and the Superstar. It was certainly a bittersweet victory for Misty Blue Sims. Granted, she did get her hand raised, but of all of you that are wrestling aficionados, no, you cannot win a title via disqualification. So Susan Sexton emerged still as the LPWA champion. Oh, it's going to get fun tonight with uh, Andre Corbeil. I'm Diana Hart, and you're watching the Andre Corbio Wrestling Show. WWE Hall of Famer legend, the lead to a dude, Roe Ranimal. And you're watching the Andre Corbio Show. Oh, what a rush. Jinder Mahal. Hey, how you doing, my friend? Good, I'll see you having me on the show. How you doing, Andrew? I'm wonderful. How are you? You're Oh, my God. The cleaner. <laughs> Stevie Richards, how you doing, my man? Very well, thank you. What's up, everybody? This is the Godfather. Relaxing. He meant relaxing. I am the Laredo Kid, the most complete luchador in the world, and you're watching Wrestling with Wrestling.com. Paul Orndorff, and you're watching the Andre Corbeil Show. That looks okay. I'm sorry, guys. Wrestling, honor, tradition. Because we're all in this for one thing, wrestling. Brett the Hitman Hart, how are you doing? I'm doing good. Hey, look to my left here. We got the hardcore legend, an icon in this industry, none other than Mick Foley. You are watching wrestling with wrestling.com. The Russian Nightmare, Nikita Kola. This is Nick Magnus Aldis, and you're watching the Andre Kovale Show. I'm Kevin Sullivan, the Taskmaster, and I'm proud to be here with wrestling with wrestling.com. This is mostly you're watching wrestling with wrestling.com. Psychosis, Mexico, LWO, forever, papi. Brian Cage, and you're watching Wrestling with Wrestling. This is the one, the only, the masterpiece, Chris Masters. Hi, this is the pretty badass, Kelly Klein, and you are watching The Andre Corville Show. I'm the last real man, Cyrus Young. This is the zombie princess, Jimmy Jacobs, and I want you to keep watching... This is the Triple X Division Champion, the one true ace, Ace Austin. You are watching Wrestling with Wrestling. This is the Ring of Honor World Champion, Matt Taven. Yo, we're the Bulls. This is the total package, Lex Luger. Formerly the genius of WWE, and I want to recommend wrestling with wrestling. You're here with Impact Superstar Raj Singh, and you're watching Wrestling with Wrestling with Andre Corbio. Hey, this is Davey Boy Smith Jr. You're watching Wrestling with Wrestling. We're going to have a reunion of sorts, where I, 
Brian Pillman Jr. are going to make you my property. <laughs> Matt Hart, Ted Hart, you're watching WrestlingWithWrestling.com. You are watching Wrestling with Wrestling.com. Thanks for tuning in, wrestling fans, and we're all in this for one thing, wrestling. Thanks for coming.